Shirley MacLaine, a well-experienced actress in classic Hollywood, has made a lasting impact on the entertainment industry. She's been acting for a long time with many memorable performances that people really love. Whether it's a specific scene or a whole movie, a lot of folks have been touched by her work in movies. We'd like to hear from you. Is there a moment from one of her movies that you really liked? Or maybe you have a personal story about how Shirley MacLaine inspired or affected your life. Share your memories and stories in the comments below. Keep an eye out for more interesting, funny, and touching facts about this Hollywood star. There are many stories to come. Shirley MacLaine, an accomplished actress in classic Hollywood, holds a special place in the world of entertainment. Her long and impactful career has left a lasting impression. Born in 1934, she started acting with passion, bringing characters to life in a way that goes beyond the screen. Her importance lies not just in the number of years spent in acting, but in the deep influence she had on viewers. McLean's talent for making roles relatable and touching sets her apart as a celebrated figure in cinema. What truly makes her worth celebrating is the wide range she showed Wood in her performances, seamlessly moving through different genres. Whether it was a heartfelt drama or a light-hearted comedy, McLean navigated the world of movies with skill and grace. Her influence extends beyond the screen, touching the lives of those who have witnessed her artistry. Appreciation grows for the versatility she brought to her roles from her early days in the industry to the present. Shirley MacLaine's work remains a source of inspiration for aspiring actors and a cherished memory for those who have followed with her journey. Do you have a favorite moment from one of her movies? Perhaps there's a personal story of how MacLaine's performances left an imprint on your life. Your memories and anecdotes add to the rich legacy, reminding us all of the powerful impact of a talented and dedicated artist. Stay tuned for more insights into the life and career of this Hollywood star. There are many stories yet to unfold, each adding to the captivating narrative of Shirley MacLaine's enduring influence in the world of cinema. Shirley MacLaine took a unique literary turn in 2007 with her book, Saging While Aging, Reflecting on Aging and the Wisdom that Comes with It. The seasoned actress brought a dynamic touch to her role as Fran Kubelik in The Apartment. During filming, elements like the gin rummy game were added as she learned it from her Rat Pack friends. The script evolved organically, capturing spontaneous moments like her impromptu musings on love during a lunch break seamlessly integrated into the narrative. Her collaboration with director Herbert Ross extended to different films. In The Turning Point, she played Tom Skerritt's wife, while in Steel Magnolias, she portrayed his neighbor. The connection between the two movies lies not only in McLean's consistent performance, but also in the shared directorial vision of Herbert Ross. On-screen versatility shines through in these varied roles, showcasing McLean's ability to navigate different genres effortlessly. Her influence extends beyond the screen, resonating with audiences and leaving a lasting impression. As her career unfolded, McLean shaped narratives and contributed uniquely to each project undertaken. Shirley MacLaine played a key role in shaping the film What a Way to Go. Her assertiveness in the project was evident as she portrayed the character Louisa May Foster. MacLaine insisted on bringing in Edith Head from Paramount for costume design, a decision that earned Head her 26th Oscar nomination for Best Costume Design. However, the award that year went to Cecil Beaton for My Fair Lady, the Best Picture winner. In 2016, McLean was the fifth earliest surviving recipient of a Best Actress Oscar nomination. Her 1958 nomination for Some Came Running put her in the company of Olivia de Havilland, Leslie Caron, Carol Baker, and Joanne Woodward. This highlights her lasting influence on cinema over the decades, placing her among the early pioneers in the industry. Beyond her on-screen roles, McLean added a literary dimension to her career with the release of the book Dancing in the Light in 1985. This literary endeavor offered a unique insight into her thoughts and experiences, showcasing her versatility beyond the confines of film. Shirley MacLaine seamlessly transitioned between different roles and genres, not just on the silver screen, but in various artistic expressions. She continued to evolve, leaving a lasting impact on different facets of the entertainment industry. Shirley MacLaine's journey in the film industry continued with the completion of Closing the Ring in 2007, a movie shot in both Northern Ireland and Canada during June 2006. This project added another chapter to her extensive filmography, showcasing commitment to diverse projects. 
In a display of dedication, McLean swiftly returned to work just four months after welcoming her daughter, Sachai Parker, into the world. Her professionalism shone through as she worked on filming Hot Spell in 1958, illustrating resilience and passion for her craft. Notably, McLean's personal life diverged from traditional norms, maintaining an open relationship with her ex-husband, Steve Parker. While he resided in Japan with their daughter, McLean focused on her career, showcasing a unique approach to balancing personal and professional aspects. These glimpses into her life highlight the ability to navigate both the demands of motherhood and the rigorous film industry. Choices, whether in selecting projects or managing relationships, reflect a person unapologetically dedicated to convictions. Shirley MacLaine's love for horses goes beyond the glitz of Hollywood. The renowned actress, known for her roles on the silver screen, has a deep passion for these majestic animals. This personal aspect of her life adds a unique touch to her overall character. In the mid-1970s, during a musical performance at Chrysler Hall in Norfolk, Virginia, MacLaine took a bold step. Uncompromising in her standards, she walked out due to poor acoustics and a problematic sound system. Chrysler Hall, known for such issues, later underwent extensive renovations thanks to McLean's vocal objections, showing the impact she had on improving the venue. Reflecting on her role as Ginny Moorhead in Some Came Running, McLean shared insights into Dean Martin's performance. She believed it to be his best, drawing parallels between the character and Martin's real-life persona as a loner with his own code of ethics. For McLean, it wasn't just a performance. It was an authentic portrayal of a character resonating with Martin's essence. Shirley McLean, a trailblazer in Hollywood, not only showcases her on-screen versatility, but also stands firm in her principles, whether advocating for better acoustics or appreciating the authenticity in her co-star's performances. Shirley MacLaine's connection with the Rat Pack added an extra layer to her extensive career. In the 1960 film Ocean's Eleven, she appeared alongside Rat Pack members, building close friendships that continued beyond that project. This collaboration extended to films like Some Came Running, Cannonball Run 2, and Ken Ken, solidifying her ties within the group. The Rat Pack's influence on her work was clear, even incorporating the gin rummy game into the apartment based on shared experiences. In What a Way to Go, McLean's role as Louisa May Foster was initially linked to Elizabeth Taylor after Marilyn Monroe's passing. However, McLean eventually took on the part, adding her unique touch. This flexibility in casting decisions highlights the dynamic nature of the industry, where roles can shift between actors impacting the final cinematic product. Despite both being Hollywood figures, Shirley McLean and her brother Warren Beatty have never collaborated on a feature film as of 2018. This separation in their professional journeys showcases their individual paths within the industry, each carving out their own niche. Shirley McLean's ability to influence not only her performances, but also the creative aspects of her projects is evident in her assertiveness during the making of What a Way to Go. Her insistence on bringing in Edith Head for costume design, resulting in an Oscar nomination for Head, showcases McLean's influence beyond acting. Reflecting on McLean's career, it becomes clear that her choices, whether in roles, collaborations, or personal life, define her legacy. Her commitment to diverse projects, resilience in the face of personal challenges, and dedication to artistic standards make her a unique and influential figure in the entertainment landscape.